global challenges issue is based on complex scientific processes. However, right from the start of this course, you will learn that there is more to it than, than, than just this. That's a hard question. <laughs> um... Global challenges is a good way of breaking out of your normal degree and seeing things from a different perspective. This is just one, one piece of a tangled web connecting fields like history, sociology, mass media, and even politics. The application of synthetic biology, because before I wasn't really um, familiar with this field, and now I know uh, there are so many applications of this. The most interesting thing I've learned is that there, there's a lot of opportunity out there for improvement. But actually implementing that is very difficult. Um, so, may, so there are s solutions that may work, um, filters and, um, and, and collecting systems, but actually having them integrated into a community um, effectively is, is quite is quite tricky. Because of the theme we are working on, synthetic synthetic biology, which is something that I didn't know about and I find it quite interesting to get to know the new field and trying to communicate that in art language. The most interesting thing I've learned so far is how you, the different members in the groups come up with different ideas and we have to um, debate each one's ideas and because everyone thinks their idea is the best so we have to argue out why someone else why we think someone else's idea is not as good as ours and so just that particular part of it was really um, interesting and it taught me a lot of group dynamics. It's been really interesting to look at the different ways to think about the context of science because you know when, a, when we're in our lectures we just learn you know this experiment did this, this is what they found, this is how they're developing this whereas this course it actually makes you think about how that impacts the wider world and the public and the people who these, discuss, these discoveries might actually you know affect. Even though my degree is an applied degree, this shows me how to use this applied knowledge to help other people around the world. Right now, I'm doing a project to help people in Vietnam get access to better drinking water. My favourite aspect is the way we're constantly challenged uh, in, in uh, working in a team environment. I really enjoy this course because it's a chance to do something creative, which you don't often get in science and it makes you think about science in a different way as well, which is quite useful. In this course you design your own question, which is basically a problem which is in real life, and we're in Vietnam, and you then come up with your own solution, so it's very much orientated about what you want to do and how you want to help. I'm enjoying the course so far because it really did allow me to work with people from other courses, which I don't usually get get to really interact with your group like you do make quite a little sort of family um, and you all kind of share your ideas and you only you only see each other for a couple of hours a week but you get quite close which is nice as well yeah no I really enjoyed and met some lovely people from upper years and uh, I get to go for coffee and cake quite often and that's all yeah. <laughs> it's alright actually that's the one thing I was worried about when I started this course um, but the workload hasn't been too bad. Um, it's only a couple of hours a week, and most of it's during this session. So it's, you know, it's kind of in one manageable lump. If that makes sense. Uh, currently, the workload uh, workload's okay to, uh, in the group. Uh, we basically do a lot of the group work in the session itself, uh, and then we, as I said, we have the online black blackboard resource. It's manageable. It's completely manageable. Maybe like an hour or two hours per week outside the. Uh, actual meeting, so it's manageable. I'll definitely recommend this to other students because it's such a important topic. Yes, definitely. I would definitely recommend it not just engineering students but even medics or scientists because um, there are a lot of perspectives needed for this course and not just engineering perspectives so everyone should get involved and I would definitely recommend anyone, all my friends even. I would definitely recommend this course to uh, other students just just because the sheer amount of uh, sheer amount of topics you do discuss within this course and the fact that you work together with so many so many different people. It's amazing.